What is up you guys, Glitches here, and welcome back to Hogwarts Legacy. We are now on episode five, a quick recap of what went down last episode. If you missed it, um, we actually got a new spell, Disillusionment, which allowed us to sneak into the restricted section of the Hogwarts library. Um, and when we went through that, we came across a little dungeon, and at the end of it, we found this uh, mysterious book, which we then brought back to Professor Fig. He went and uh, tried doing some research on it, and we found out that two important pages were missing. So he is now going to be heading off to a meeting with the ministry and uh, going to be studying the book. And he told us to continue on with our studies. We are now uh, heading to herbology class, and uh, hopefully over the next couple episodes, we'll figure out the mystery behind the missing pages as well. So without any further ado, let's jump back into it and head to class. Oh, I also, as you guys can see, ranked up a little bit. We got a few levels. Um, pretty much all the side quests that I had, with the exception of the uh, Dedalian Keys and um, Professor Hakat's secondary assignment. Um, all of the secondary ones that I had that just gave like small wand accessory upgrades and stuff like that. Um, I did those off camera. Um, that's probably what I'll do for the rest of this, just so we can kind of stick to a seamless story playthrough. Um, but yeah, that got us a nice little upgrade. Um, but yeah, we got two main story missions here. Hopefully we can knock them both out during this episode. So let's continue on here. Rebellion. Want to scope the place out first, real quick. Revelio. Oh, little uniform upgrade. It's a nice little jump. Rebellion. Got a bunch more field pages too. Look, that's everything down here. Cool. Good morning, Professor Garlic. How wonderful it is to see you again, Lenora. Professor dear. Garlic. Oh, here. You'll need these for today's class. Uh, um, uh, A little treat for your auntie. She seems oh, nice. Oh, hello. Class, please welcome the newest rose in our garden. We do look forward to growing our main man, Sebastian. He also didn't How rat us out in the uh, restricted section because we technically did get this caught. This year will be filled with enchantment and excitement, but the most important thing cultivated in herbology is knowledge. 
The prudent herbologist is no more afraid of the venomous tentacular than the bouncing bulb. Now then, today we will be acquainting ourselves with the mellifluous tuber known as the mandrake root. Accio. Let's see if we can't make our fibrous friends a bit more comfortable, shall we? <laughs> First, let's protect our ears. <laughs> now, everyone, grip the mandrake by the tendrils and give it a firm tug. like a warm, dirty blanket, putting the mandrake right at ease. Repair it. I'm very sorry about that. Yours was a bit mature, I'm afraid. All right, then. Off you go. Nothing we can't handle. Everyone. Now, Rebellion. for our next task, We'll be planting Dittany at our potting tables. You can all get started. I need to have a brief word with our new student. Hmm. I wonder if him. I adore playing with the chess with my siblings. A bit violent, but father says it's a good way to get out our frustrations. Yes, Professor. Firstly, well done with your mandrake. They can be rather difficult to get a grasp of. Actually, I enjoyed it. I couldn't help but catch your enthusiasm. How kind of you. It seems you're already taking to herbology like a mandrake to fresh soil. Now, as I mentioned, next we'll be planting dittany. Let us find you some seeds. I already have some, Professor. Pick them up in Hogsmeade. You visited the Magic Neep. Wonderful! A prepared student is bound to bloom. I've arranged for you to have your own potting table here in the classroom. Wasn't easy to spare one on such late notice. Plant the seeds there now, and you can return to harvest them later. Even with soil, sunlight, and a bit of magic, they will take time to grow. Let's see how to balance my star thistle arrangement. Revelio. If it's fancy, or roses. Dittany's restorative properties make it a vital ingredient in the Wiganwell potion, as you all should know from Professor Sharp's class. It's not going to be down for nine minutes. Ten minutes. Well done! Once it can be harvested, your destiny will be ready to use in Wiganweld Potion. I'll let Professor Sharp tell you about that. Now, what say we branch out? Introduce you to a different sort of flora. The Chinese chomping cabbage. You'll find that some plants are better suited to uses outside of a cauldron. The cabbages do get testy without something to chew. Fortunately, I have a dummy for them to gnaw on. Be a dear, and let them have a good chomping. Yes, Professor. They're in the other greenhouse. It's just at the end of the footbridge leading out of this room. Your classmate, Mr. Pruitt, has kindly offered to accompany you. Come back and see me when you're finished. Oh, and mind your fingers. They do bite. Hello. Saw you on your way to Hogsmeade the other day. Nice to meet you. I'm Leander. I'll be showing you the Chinese chomping cabbages. Up these stairs will take us there, but your lead. Nice work in defense against the dark arts, by the way. Excuse me? Your duel with Sebastian. And he's good. <laughs> Thinks he's really good. But you outright. Here we are, Revelia, home of the Chinese chomping cabbage. Go on. Now, see that dummy? Just toss the cabbages at it, and they'll do the rest. Okay. Hmm. 
on <laughs> mum planted some in her garden last year to keep the gnomes out did save her the denoming but they left her honking daffodils in tatters vicious little bastards aren't they my kind of plants not like stupid booba tubers and bouncing bulbs the kind of plants that just have your back in a fight uh, not saying you can't go it alone but well imagine that wasn't a dummy i suppose they could prove useful outside of the greenhouse Nothing wrong with a bit of backup, even if it is from a cabbage. It's chaos out there. Trolls in Hogsmeade and such. You can't be above throwing a cruciferous vegetable if necessary. Dogweed and Deathcap has more of them, if you're keen. Other plants too. Ones your parents wouldn't plant in the garden. You get the idea. Anyway, we uh, probably ought to head back to class. Take your time. Ravelli. Let's go back in class. That's a big boy lock. That looks like a level three. And with that helpful reminder as to why we should always wear our dragon hide. I tended to the Chinese chomping cabbages, Professor. Remarkable plants, aren't they? I hope they weren't too much trouble. Oh, don't see any bite marks or missing digits. And good, as you do seem to be quite green fingered. Oh, I'm eager to see your skill in the soil continue to blossom. Magical plants have so much to offer. I'm eager to learn more. I'm glad. Herbology is a bounteous subject. Tend to your garden, and it will tend to you. Huh. Well, I suppose that's everything. Do come by for a chat sometime. I so enjoy checking in with my new students. Herbology class completed. Really relishing their new pots. Only cost so me we my can come back in five day. minutes if we want and snag that one. We'll grab it uh, once our next quest is done, which is potions class. Actually. Probably fast travel there. That one seems pretty close. You can't imagine how inconvenient travel was before I invented flu powder. Rebellion. Back for the last time, I have a someone from the ministry got into school right after down. the incident in Hogsmeade. Professor Black would never allow that. I think that's Dobby. It made him look completely incompetent, which he is. <laughs> Rebellion. Yes, I bet he knows more than he's letting on about the. What is down here? Quick little chest. Rebellion. Knew there had to be something in here.
Solutions is one of the most challenging and hazardous subjects taught at this school. As fifth years, you will be required to reach new heights of both discipline and intellect. You will begin this term by brewing a Wigan Weld potion. Mr. Takar, can you tell us why this particular potion might come in handy? Yes, Professor Sharp. The Wigan Weld potion can be used to sterilize and even heal a variety of injuries. It can heal some injuries, but not all. Points for Ravenclaw. Before today's class is completed, each of you Didn't will have a Slytherin cloak on? Potion of your own. You never know when you might need it. Please begin. Use a strong, even motion when crushing your ingredients. Please be meticulous when adding powder to your potions. One errant sneeze could be disastrous. Gonna be calling me the Half-Blood Prince soon. I see most of you have not forgotten how to stir. Hmm. Not an easy potion to brew. Well done. And from what I hear of your recent exploits in Hogsmeade, you'd also do well to practice brewing the defensive Edurus potion. Professor Weasley had you acquire the recipe from Jay Pippins, correct? Yes, sir. Good. For the moment, you can find the ingredients you need in my office. But in the future, you'll be expected to provide your own ingredients. Some can be harvested from the plants you grow in your herbology class, and rarer ones can be purchased. Others, however, may be harder to obtain, and will require you to be a bit more... resourceful. Come and see me when you've finished brewing. And we'll see if it was skill or luck the first time around. My parents considered keeping me home from school this year after the rumors of... Did I hear Professor Sharp say that you have permission to go into his office? He did say that. He wants me to get more ingredients to brew another potion. Brilliant! You, my friend, have been presented with an extraordinary opportunity. You remember me, don't you? Gareth Weasley. Ah, yes. We met in the common room. Listen, anyone with a troll-sized brain can brew an Adurus potion. I'm working on something that's certain to be spectacular. I'm just missing one tiny last ingredient that will add that extra spark. I suspect that's where I come in. You're as clever as I'd hoped. I simply need a single fooper feather, as you'll already be in Sharp's office with his permission. Perhaps you could grab it for me. I'll get you the Fwooper Feather, as long as you're certain Sharp won't miss it. I assure you he won't. Fwooper Feathers aren't that valuable. Wait until you see what I'm brewing. Hurry back to me when you have the feather. Your potion should not be that color. Revelio. stations organized and free of clutter. Here's the Fwoppa feather you wanted. Brilliant! Thank you! This is going to take a moment to brew. You should get back to brewing your Adurus potion, and I'll tell you when this concoction's finished. Proficiency in potions are two things that cannot be rushed. Have patience and be thorough. Almost done. 20 seconds. Potion that enhances the drinker's defense by covering them with durable rocky skin. Interesting. Be 
to even make a Felix Felicis. This, I believe, was a bonus unlock for having the PS5 version pre-ordered. Should be an extra quest, too, that we can do later on. Enhances the drinker's chance of success in their endeavors, specifically by revealing the location of a large loot chest on the minimap for one in game day. That's pretty cool. Won't have to sit there and cast Revelio 50 million times. Almost done. Nice. And now we add the Mallow Suite, and that's odd. What's happening? Wait, it's not supposed to. Ah! Get it! Again. Oh. Dragon Dog. What happened? <laughs> well done, Gareth. What now, Mr. Weasley? Sorry, Professor. That'll be points from Gryffindor again. Mr. Thanks Weasley a lot. did not do this on his own. His accomplice will answer to me as well. I brewed an Adura's potion as you asked, Professor. I'm surprised you had the time. You seemed rather busy helping Mr. Weasley brew chaos. Wasn't me. I'm not sure what you're talking about, Professor. You will not earn favor with me by failing to take responsibility for your actions. I suggest you heed my warning. As for the work you did today at your own cauldron, I will say you've done well. I confess I was skeptical given the advanced nature of this class and the fact you're a new student. I'm glad I was able to meet your expectations. A rare occurrence. And you do well to remember that you're not a potions master quite yet. In addition to having a solid grasp of how to combine various ingredients, you should gain an understanding of the ingredients themselves. Pay particular attention in herbology. The plants you nurture there are often essential to the potions you brew here. Now, I recommend that you find a safe location in which to practice brewing. You cannot leave a hot cauldron simply anywhere. That'll be all. I think each of us has had enough excitement for one Rebellion. day. Class is dismissed. Ugh, my robes are going to reek from that. Hey, level up. Now, Handy resource indeed. Alright, what's next? Now we gotta meet our friend at Hogsfield. And this is a place outside of the Hogwarts grounds. Let's get this little flu, uh, flu powder location here. I've always said that there travel broadens the mind. Man, it'll be so nice when we can finally fly around all these areas. Revelio. And unlock doors. <laughs> OK. 
Gotta be a field guide something here. Nothing, huh? Surprising. Revelio. I'll snag these though. Revelio. up there. I'll take that. Definitely an increase. Oh, is this the uh, owl tower? It is. Rebellion. Nice. Oh, there's a ladder. <laughs> oh, Let me know what do. Did I see a page flying around here, too. Revelio. I did. Accurate. Got it. Revelio. Man, I can't get over the views in this game. Like, look at that. That's unreal. Looks so cool. Surprised there's not a uh, blue powder location here. Got one here. What are you up to now? That'll save a little bit of time. Man. That's so cool. Rebellion. Those must be the balloons we can get when we're on our broom. Oh, this must be uh, Hagrid's hut. Did 
This is 100% aggravating. Oh no. Oh no. This is what we're going to do. Hogsmeade. I'm going to quickly sell some stuff and we're going to come back. Does it get any more cozy than Hogsmeade? Anyone can run a stop. Before you ask, I'm all out of the new socks, so if your feet are smelly, you'll have to work it out for yourself. Dang, those are pretty big upgrades. Forty one compared to twenty nine, that's a really big upgrade. But we're already I way above you have level. A sharp eye for fashion. Be sure to stop by whenever you're about. Cool. So now Like this location on map. Closest one we found. Is right here. Or is it? Source indeed, your field guide. I'm most pleased to be included. That's not where I meant to go. Could have sworn we had a uh, waypoint there. So I can still consider part of Hogwarts. It's gotta be. Yeah, okay. All right, so I'll have to run back a little bit, but we're still pretty close. At least our inventory is full now, or empty, I mean. Yeah, this is definitely Hagrid's hut. Better hat. Another better hat. It's unfortunate. Let's see which one's better here. 29, 26. That's the one we're going with. Rebellion. So there's a little side quest thing here. Really? Just jump. Wonder what this is. Rebellion. 
Revelio. Incendio. Accio. Revelio. Revelio. Nothing else in here except a crappy chest. Revelio. Revelio. Hmm. I wonder what that is. Something we'll have to come back to. Almost there. Looks like we maybe have a side quest over here. Might Pick this up. For some assistance. Hello, can I help you? Oh, thank goodness. Yes, my name is Grace Pinch Smedley. Of the Bath Pinch Smedleys? I was hoping someone would come along soon. I was about to defy my father's wishes and would never have forgiven myself. You see, I need to retrieve something from the bottom of the lake. Might you be the one to help me? Diving into the lake sounds like an adventure. Tell me more. Splendid! Precisely the response I'd hoped for. What do you need help retrieving? Years ago, my grandfather, who fancied himself quite the astronomer, set sail from Hogsmeade Station for what was meant to be a quick stargazing cruise with my grandmother. They never returned. I'm so sorry. What happened to them? We can't be sure. We only know that neither they nor their boat made it back to shore. They were presumed drowned. Father was so distraught that he forbade our family from setting foot on or in the Black Lake ever again. A treasured family astrolabe vanished with them that night. If you could dive down and retrieve it, I may be able to bring my father some peace. Do what we could do. Hmm, it sounds dangerous, especially for something of mere sentimental value. I understand, but I'd be forever grateful. Of course, you may discover much more than the astrolabe. Anything else you found would be all yours. I've cross-referenced the vessel's last alleged location against the lake's topography, depth charts, and tide schedule. Oh, My best be guess is that it's just over there, about a furlong from the dock. It would be wonderful to have my grandfather's astrolabe back. I do hope you find the astrolabe. It would mean so much to our family. It sounds as if her astrolabe is just northeast of the dock. I should dive down and see. It is good to see you, my friend. Hello, Natty. How are you? 
I am well, thank you. I was there, and I saw what happened with Rookwood and Harlow at the Three Broomsticks. I have been worried about you. I'm all right at the moment. If you don't mind my asking, why were they looking for you? I've never met Rookwood or Harlow. Perhaps they mistook me for another student. Hmm. A bit odd. The two of them pursuing a Hogwarts student so intently. But whatever the reason, you were clearly in danger. For now, it is safe to say that Rookwood and Harlow are a threat to both of us. To all of us. Which is why I wanted to speak to you. Everyone has been talking about you defending Hogsmeade from that troll attack. And I shall never forget watching Serona stand up to Rookwood and Harlow in the Three Broomsticks. Both of you have inspired me to take a stand of my own. What sort of stand? Men like Rookwood and Harlow are the reason my mother and I left Matibili land. I am not going to sit by and watch them destroy my new home. Good. Rookwood and Harlow are a dangerous pair. And you should know that Rookwood is in league with Ranrock. I had heard they were seen in Hogsmeade together. All the more reason they must be stopped. Rumor has it that Theophilus Harlow runs Rookwood's day-to-day -day operations. Taking him down would cripple Rookwood's entire enterprise. That may be true, but shouldn't Officer Singer handle someone like Harlow? I spoke with her. She was polite, but perhaps understandably would not discuss details with a student. I overheard some of Rookwood's lot talking about a massive poaching operation that Harlow is planning. I was thinking that we could investigate a bit, try to get the evidence that Officer Singer needs. All right, but how? I am going to watch and listen, find out precisely what Harlow is up to. I shall reach out when I know more. In the meantime, remember, I am here if you need me. Thank you, Natty. Be on your guard. How Rebellion. Nice to see you, my young friend. I beg your pardon. How dare you threaten me? What's going on here? Fifteen. Looks like we got a bender here. I never side. thought Ramrock's loyalists would go this far. New cloak. That's quite the upgrade. Arn. Oh, I think I remember seeing a video. This guy has a Pardon broom me. that we can get. Is everything all right? Hardly. I've just lost my business and almost my life. You'd best look elsewhere for wares. I've nothing to sell now. Oh, I never thought it'd come to this. Be on your guard. Ranrock and his loyalists will spare no one. They attacked you. Oh, Ranrock has no patience for goblins who won't join him. While I too would like to see goblin kind treated by wizards as equals, bloodshed is not the answer. When I said as much, they turned on me, struck me till I nearly passed out took my carts, my belongings, even that which is most precious to me, my paintings. I'm sorry this happened to you. I shall certainly keep an eye out for your carts. That is very kind of you, but I think they took them to their camp southwest of here, just past some ruins. Too dangerous to try and retrieve them. I did enchant the carts to return to me if I ever lost them, however. Slim though the chances may be. I'm holding out hope that some of what was taken is returned to me. It was nice meeting you. Revelio. Wish it had been under better circumstances. But, Mummy, 
Archie, I don't have time to argue. After what Ranrock did to that goblin banker at Gringotts, I shouldn't be surprised at what happened to Arm. But you should see the mummy. How beautiful. These horses with wings. Oh, oh, that's enough. I'm too tired for your stories today. You stay right here where I can see you. Now, How am I supposed to get that? Why don't you do some more drawings for me? Hmm? Very well, mummy. Hunter to the house. Revelio. Hmm. Revelio. Can't open that. That one's locked. Wand extension. Hello, sir. What do you sell here? Hello. I'm Jalal Semi, and this is my potion shop. I can answer any questions you have about the town. What do you have for sale? What can I help you with today? Maxima potions are always good. Might as well sell this I'll stuff. I'll have no trouble selling this. Thank you. Ooh, when did we get that? That's I'll snazzy, see you too. Again sometime. 31, 32. We'll take it. Revelio. We also have to uh, dodge eight more attacks for a side quest. Far away is this camp? Might as well. We got a little bit of time. Revelio.
Revelio. Action. Past the ruins. I'm on the right track. Revelio. Doing this sort of thing forever, though. Fancy I'll have my own operation work out one day. <laughs> Might as well get that done. Revelio. Looks as if there's more than one way to enter. will regret not joining us. If he doesn't come round now, he'll be made even more of an example. We should have killed him. Scoping the place out here. thought it said there's more than one way to enter, but I only see one entrance. Need a sword like it. Shouldn't be here right now. Run, run, will you knight us? We need to uh, expel the armus. Guess what we can do? 
Let's head back. So here. Come back for that actually once we have this spell because that'll help us clear out that camp. What are you up to now? Oh, I also need to wait till it's daytime. Professor, I wondered, did you attend Hogwarts? I did. I am a proud member of Ravenclaw House. Why do you ask? I was curious as to how Hogwarts has changed over the years. I see. Well, the castle itself, as I'm sure you have surmised, is full of surprises. I dare say more than the staircases change around here. As for the students, well, they seem to get more capable every year. Although, we got up to just as much mischief in my day as you seem to now. I used to look the other way at all sorts of roguery when I was head girl. I can tell you, however, that I did once admonish a certain Phineas Nigellus Black for enjoying a sugar quill during a lecture. Uh, I, I hadn't realized that you and Professor Black were, uh, students here together. <laughs> Appearances can be deceiving. You see, I was once wounded by time itself. Time itself? I never would have imagined such a thing. Ah, well, it was the risk I took with my prior position. You may or may not have heard that I was an unspeakable at the Ministry for years. An unspeakable? What does... Uh, as you might suspect, I cannot speak about what we did. Suffice it to say, the job was not without its hazards. Now, I hope I've satisfied your curiosity for the moment. You have. Thank you for speaking with me, Professor. Keep up with your wand work. One must always be prepared for mischief, both inside and outside of the castle. I thought that's who I was supposed to talk to for this mission. Oh, there we go. take care of everything I had asked you to do. We have. Professor, I completed all of your most recent assignments. Well done. Then you're ready to learn Expelliarmus. Pay close attention. The disarming charm may often be all you need to defeat the most powerful dark witches and wizards you might encounter. Spell casting requires a focused mind and a steady wand. There we go. Good work. The dummy is here if you wish to stay in practice. Expelliarmus. You seem to have the right end of the stick, but keep practicing. Expelliarmus may save your life one day. Accio. Expelliarmus. Leviosa. Instantly. Spell the armors to Sarms of Wands. Disarms wands and weapons from the most from most enemies who wield them. Also deals damage to all enemies, even if they do not carry a weapon. Ah. 
Well, there's the crossbow that it was telling me to steal from the other guy. The combat thing. Cool. You can't imagine how inconvenient. Oh, we had potions class, herbology class, and we got a brand new spell. We also uh, got a few side quests that we're gonna have to do here soon. Let's say that was a good, uh, solid day and a good place to end the episode. If you guys enjoyed it, be sure to smash that like button, leave a comment down below. I appreciate all of your feedback. And as always, if you want to keep up to date on all the future episodes of the series, consider subscribing and turn on that notification bell. Till the next one, you guys. I hope you all had a great day, and thanks for watching.